Hello everyone and welcome back to Whimsy Creek Art. My name is Megan and today is Short Tip Saturday. So every Saturday I just have a video with a couple of short tips. So today's tips are to do with flip cups. The flip cup technique with fluid acrylics. So here I have three cups and an 11 by 14 inch canvas. And I'm pouring some browns and some blues, a little yellow ochre, and a little bit of turquoise in here. The yellow ochre and the phthalo blue, the darkest blue, are the only two that have silicone. And they just have just a couple of drops of treadmill oil in them. And my paint is mixed with Floetrol. It's one part acrylic paint to three part parts Floetrol. And so I'm just layering some colors here in these three cups. And then I'm going to flip those over. But one of the tips is to not fill it completely. Give yourself a little bit of room. It gives you a little bit easier to flip that cup over if it's not quite all the way full. So if you need to do multiple cups, you maybe do multiple cups so it's not all the way full. See how it's just got a little bit of room left in there. All right, so you can go ahead and just flip it. Just go ahead and be brave and flip the cup over. Or you can use any sort of flat surface. You can use like a little toy sand shovel like this and just flip the cup using that. You can use like, I like to use old used gift cards or even a piece of plastic, piece of cardboard, anything like that to help you or just go ahead and be brave and flip those cups over. So what you're going to want to do is go, not go straight up because then you're going to get drips down. You're going to want to flip your cup, tilt it over, not pull it straight up. So each one, I'm not pulling it straight up, I'm tilting it. And then I'm just laying them over to the side to let the last little bit, there's quite a bit still coming out. And some beautiful cells popping up right away. So all right, just getting that last little bit of paint out of each of these cups. And this is an 11 by 14 inch canvas and each of those cups are three ounce cups. So you always wanna also with a flip cup, make sure that you have enough paint. If you have too little of paint, then you're trying to stretch those cells out a little bit too much. So you'll get, your cells will kind of lose if you don't have enough paint. So if you're wanting your cells to still show up, you definitely want to make sure you have enough paint or even more than enough. See how I'm holding the corner kind of at an L shape and I bring it to each corner back to the center a little bit and then off to the next corner and I just work my way around the canvas doing that, making sure I get it to each edge, each corner. And also you wanna make sure you get your edges real well because it's so much easier to fix your edges now instead of having to go back and try to touch up those edges. So, all right, got a lot of cells in this even though I only have two colors with silicone. And that's also another tip. You can really overdo it with the silicone. And this one, honestly, is almost overdone with silicone. But only two colors have silicone. And I don't even have to torch it. But you know what? I am going to go ahead and just give a little bit, mainly to pop the air bubbles. Not too many additional cells are popping up, though. And here is a close-up of our flip cap. So, all right. Thank you so much for joining me for this short tip Saturday. And I hope you are doing all right. So, next Saturday, we'll have another short tip. And all throughout the week, we'll have videos coming out and a couple of great live streams. So, thank you very much and have a great weekend.